I just want to check one last time that you're okay about this date with Mark. Oh my God, I'm so fine with it, Anne, seriously. It's so fine, as long as you and I are cool. You know my code, hoes before bros. Uteruses before deuteruses. Got it. Ovaries before broveries. Mm. You make such good coffee. I have stakeout supplies. This is stuff that we're probably gonna need. We have uh, notepads, pencils and pencil case, shakeable whipped cream, cameras, um, corp, uh, and candy necklaces. It's like we're real police. Mm. I hate salad. I ate a brownie once at a party in college. It was intense. It was kind of indescribable, actually. I felt like I was floating. Turns out there wasn't any pot in the brownie. It was just an insanely good brownie. I'm feeling a lot of confusing things right now. Yeah, no, of, of course you are. A and your friendship is the most important thing to me. And he's off limits. Thank you. I was trying to let you know I was really serious about that secret language. I know. Hey! Hey! So, I was just at the grind and I thought you might want an iced mocha with extra, extra whipped cream. Oh my, thank you so much, April. Wow. wow. You're welcome. Oh, by the way, completely unrelated, I just signed up for the Miss Pawnee Beauty pageant. That's wonderful! You know, that is why I decided to become a judge so that awesome girls like you, who are not, you know, classically hot, can be rewarded for their intelligence and savvy. It is impossible that he's not gonna like you. He's gonna freak out about how awesome you are. No, he's not. Yes, he is, he's gonna love you. You're cool, and you're sexy, and you're funny, and you're smart. Like, yeah. Any guy would be lucky to date you. Yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. yeah, I am awesome. You are awesome. Yeah. And you are too. Thank you. You are too. Thank you. You are too, Anne. Okay. You're awesome. You're awesome. Can I get anyone anything to drink before we start? Coffee, brandy? I'd love some coffee. Anything, guys? No. Some nuts? I'll have some nuts. Gummy bears? Sure. Apple crisps? No. Yeah. Granola bars? Mm -hmm. I'll take those. Nothing? Sure. Okay, I'll be right out there if you need me. I don't, I don't love the idea of corporate sponsorship, but Sweetums is an institution. When you think of Pawnee, you think of Sweetums. You've got to try this. Oh, that's really good. Isn't that gray? Mm -hmm. It's camel stomach. Is it? I'm teasing, I'm teasing. It's chicken. Uh. <laughs> Would you like to try the camel stomach? No. Who just put a hundred of these in their body? And, oh, look at you. You're looking pretty unhealthy today. You might need one of these. Nutrium by Sweetums. If you can't beat them, Sweetums. What's Galentine's Day? Oh, it's only the best day of the year. Every February 13th, my lady friends and I leave our husbands and our boyfriends at home and we just come and kick it breakfast style. Ladies celebrating ladies. It's like Lilith Fair, minus the angst. Plus frittatas. Ugh, ready to go? Yes. Your keys, please. Who's next? I feel great. Everything is running smoothly. Some of them want to use you. Some of them. Clipboard mouth. Clipboard mouth. There's some secret ingredient in these Nutri Yum bars that make me feel so good. Sugar. It's a block of sugar. <laughs> hey. Oh, hey, Anne. Sorry, I can't hang out. I kind of have an emergency. Oh, I'm actually here to see Mark. Right. Oh, well, thanks for the coffee. That's also for Mark. Mm. I really need it, though. But next time, more sugar, okay? Thanks, bye! We'd just love if you could come and join us. Sure. Anything for my favorite customer. <laughs> I bet you say that to all the girls. Oh, no, no. Actually, you're my favorite. You spent over $1,000 last year on waffles alone. Oh, hey! Hey there. I got you uh, some waffles here, courtesy of JJ's Diner, and chicken soup, courtesy of me. I'll take the waffles. Thank you. Okay. So how did the rest of the meeting go? Look, cucumber flower. Wow, that's so cute. Wait, that's a garnish. You're not supposed to eat that. Why? Yellow-haired female likes waffles and news. Sexy, well-read blonde loves the sweeter things in life. Much better. 
Mm. Thank you, darling. Why would anybody ever eat anything besides breakfast food? People are idiots, Leslie. Mm. You're a Pawnee girl. Mm -hmm. No, Leslie, I'm not. Well, then why do you come here at dinner time and get takeout from the legendary JJ's Diner? It's not for me. These waffles make great dog laxatives. Don't you dare feed that waffle to that dog to get it to poop. Sambuca need to make? There you go. Leslie. How dare you? Oh, no, get her, Leslie! Leslie. Whoa! Oh. 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 Garbage fight! This homemade bulgogi is so delicious, Kayla. This is the best Korean food I've ever had. I would say it's almost as good as lukewarm beans from a can. Right, Ron? Although I've not worked with you professionally, as a private citizen, I have personally patronized each and every one of your establishments. Mm, I've never seen you buy a salad at Sea Salad. It's because I don't hate myself, Tanya. I'm sorry. I know I should be chasing your vote, but I stand behind my decision to avoid salad and other disgusting things. And I think I have a lot of support in the community for that. You okay? It was a rough night, but I survived. Scone. They only have maple walnut. Yeah. In a way, my suspension from work was kind of a blessing. Yeah, I feel the same way about resigning in disgrace. Totally. The key is you have to keep yourself busy or else mm -hmm. you're gonna go crazy. Mm -hmm. I mean, look at me, look how busy I am. I'm inventing a new spice called Salger. It's part salt, part sugar. What could that possibly be good on? Butterscotch pudding. Fair enough. And put these scones in your bra. Let's go. Okay, can we just stop off at the um, lobby? Because the prison gift bags are amazing. Mm. I love me a calzone. Ben, I'm going crazy. First they won't let me work at the parks department. Now they won't let me campaign either. All I want to do is improve our town. And they won't let me do that. Putting an awful lot of sulgur on your pasta. This is just sugar. Okay, I need you to distract me. Talk to me about something, anything. <sighs> My heart was really set on this new job. And... Don't touch my pickles, Anne. Are you sure that you don't need more whipped cream? Not today. I don't deserve it. I got us into this mess because I was fixating on that guy. But this is ridiculous. I do need more whipped cream. Ma'am, I've only slept nine hours over the past four days, so I'm right on the verge of a nervous breakdown. This isn't a bagel. I'm in favor of a lot of things, like hot dogs. Right, Charlie? I'm Leslie Note, and I approve this message. Your tax on soda would definitely lower diabetes in this town. Oh, and I have a great prop for the meeting. This is the amount of sugar that the average Pawnee 10-year-old consumes from soda every month. That is gross. It's gross. All that sugar? It's really gross. What a powerful image. What are you doing? What did you put in the sugar? It's so good. Okay, well, I couldn't sleep a wink last night, so at five in the morning, I went to Ponch Burger for a pick-me-up. I couldn't decide what kind of soda I wanted, so I had them put all six in one cup. You know what it tastes like? Disgusting. Mm -hmm. Try it. It's an aphrodisiac. You too, my strange foreign friend. Leslie Nope soda tax forces massive layoffs. Oh my god, Ann. No. Need some sugar. Nope. No, no, no. Anna, stop need some it. sugar. Leslie, you stop it right now. What's that? Well, since I can't give her waffle iron for breakfast day, I am making her a miniature Leslie out of breakfast food. Good lord. Happy, Happy waffle day. day. Oh my god! Day waffle day joint present I have ever received. Wow. Is that Leslie Knowles? Yes. Oh, hi, Gail. What a surprise. I insist you join us for breakfast. This guy is the greatest breakfast chef in the world. No. You know, I'm not really into breakfast foods. Really? Your purse is shaped like a waffle. Is it? Are you sure you're cool with JJ's Diner catering what you've referred to as the wedding of the millennium? Are you kidding me? I thought that I could not love you any more than I already did. But I was dead wrong. Scrambled eggs, eaten with chopsticks, okay. Andy and Leslie sent us care packages. Hey, Ben, just a few things to remind you of home, love, Leslie. Ah, waffle mix. Left the chicken soup there just in case. It's a old family recipe, it's not a big deal, but. Thank you for that. Okay. 